Uh, we're on our map here. We have our legend Vincent Gladstone. We have Emerald Elysium Park, which looks like just a big, a big old party place. So we're gonna try to work our way over there. It looks like there are some enemies nearby that we can look how look how beat up they are. They need to heal. They need to go to Penster and heal. Opponents are moving. Allies are moving. Hui Jiang wants to talk. He's this a green is fist. The negotiations interface. Diplomatic alliances can be forged and trade can be conducted here. The left list contains things that you can offer, and on the right list are things you can request from the other faction. You might not be able to see all of those because of my big ugly head. Okay. What's up, man? I've recently come into contact with the commander of the Syndicate. Who's the Syndicate? Perhaps I could introduce you to them. My reconnaissance comes at a price, however. Are you willing to strike a deal? They offer contact information. Establish a relationship. Their location on the planet will not be revealed, but diplomatic interactions and effects will be enabled. And they want 100 energy. Oh, I have tons of energy. Yeah. Sina. Sina? Of House Timur. My, my, look what we got here. More volunteers to serve the glorious cause of House Timur. I was starting to think this whole expedition may have been a waste of our resources. Is this Hui's friend? <coughs> House Timur? Isn't that the kind of pretentious name the Syndicate would give to their criminal organizations? You are the ones from the ship we encountered at the Spatial Rift, aren't you? I was supposed to find an entire vanguard squad at this location. Tell me what you've done with them and I may spare you and your outlander friends. Oh, you are a feisty one. And so adorably clueless. I almost think I should keep you. Don't worry about your friends, darling. We took them into our care. You should have seen them before. They were all so awfully malnourished. Took them into your care? Turned them into slaves, you mean? The Kiriko were only a small part of the living property we found as we inspected the Syndicate. Back then, I had to obey the law and accept whenever the ones punishable could buy themselves out of their punishment. But the situation has changed. I suggest you leave the planet immediately, without your volunteers. I am sorry, darling, but the property of House Timur is non-negotiable. However, I may be convinced to refrain from further acquisitions if I am compensated for the losses caused to me by such a withdrawal. I have a list of supplementary items that can be manufactured in your colonies. Provide me with enough of them and I shall reconsider your request. What should I do? I want Cena off the planet, but do we want another full-scale war? Meeting her demand seems risky, since she may be stalling until backup arrives. The only thing I can say for sure is that whichever option I choose, dealing with her will not going to be an easy task. It will not going to be... Objective completed. That was the alien ship? I get a gunship. Cooperate with Cena. Provide Cena with a list of supplementary goods that you can build in your colonies. Hmm, I want 500 production. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. A hero join offer. Mara Jason wants to join you. He's an assault bike hero. Um, not much personality on the assault bike. It's just a man in an assault bike. Can I turn this? <laughs> I want to I want to see Mara. <clears throat> Sinumbra. Who is this person? Where does this person come from? Request another hero. I don't trust it. I don't trust it. Let's see. If this guy heals a bunch, that'll be good. Ah, what happened? Looks like our little robot found has found himself some company. 
Though, wait a second, aren't those road sweeper units patrolling the streets? I may not be an expert on maintenance robots, but the last time I checked, they didn't require any laser guns to do their cleanup. Troop hygiene must have really dropped since we've left. Ha! Good one, Commander! Though I doubt this place has seen any visitors that would have appreciated a clean walkway in quite a while. It looks completely deserted. Agreed. Either way, I suggest we interrupt this particular mopping up before your little pet gets blown into pieces. Objective completed. We found Tapples. In this... the like, derelict city, apparently? Got some energy in production. Rescue Tapples before it gets attacked by the maintenance droids. What are we looking at here? It doesn't show us what the enemy is. It's a good landmark, though. Hmm. Okay, we're in kind of a race against time to save Puggles, it sounds like. No, Tapples. His name's Tapples, he is a pug. So I think instead of going to Emerald Elysium Park, we're going to just make sure we heal up here, recruit a few more units, and then head down. Go after Tapples. We'll continue exploring. Check out Sentry Station. Just random stuff held by them. Can you get over here to the, uh... Energy? The freebie? The whatever? It is energy. Free 29 energy. Good. Thief's Gully. I can build a forward base here. Is this not owned by them? Unclaimed Wilderness. I could found a colony here if I got my uh, colonizer this way. That could be good. Where's my colonizer? Did it die? Did it die in that auto battle? Oh my god. Okay. A gunship. Okay, cool. That's the kind of reinforcements they need, so you head this way. You need to build a new colonizer, I guess. You're gonna carry on to this resource node. Ah, that has a freaking paragon in it. Just hunker down. Are you healing? You're supposed to be healing. Who's, who still has moves? You? Okay. Picked up more free energy. <clears throat> and a thousand peaks. A pirate spawner. Okay. Yep, we're definitely coming down this way. They're just hanging out there, that's good. Syndicate agent approaches. Good day, Colonel. It has come to my attention that you are having some trouble with Sina of House Timur. I heard of her demands, and believe me, they won't be her last ones. I know a subtle, yet effective way to get her off the planet. Interested? That depends. First tell me who you are and why you should even want to help me. Then we can talk. I'm a friend. A friend who has a certain interest in seeing Sina retreat from this planet. Anything to damage House Timur. I have incriminating information about Sina's past. Her ascension onto Throne Timur wasn't all sunshine and roses. There are some people who'd try to kill her if they learned how she acquired her current position. All you need to do is show her you have proof of what happened, and she should be more... cooperative. I'm interested. And I suppose you can provide me with such proof? I am listening. 
Yes. <coughs> Indeed, I can. Meet me at those coordinates, and be sure to be less noisy for when I've seen stealth that isn't your soldier's most distinguished quality. Go to the received coordinates. Hey, my drone's right there. Can I send my drone in my stead? <laughs> Didn't I tell you to be subtle coming here? Now we have an entire gang of assassins on our hands. How could I have been more subtle? Either that or it was a trap all along. For all I know, your whole story of trying to help me against Cena was just a setup to lure us here. I suggest you make up your mind about this quickly. I have no intentions of dying here today. Objective complete. Protect the agent against the assassins sent after her. So, I'm not really in a position to do that. <laughs> so I guess you're fucked. Bye. I don't have an army up here. This was a mistake. Operations primed and ready. Ah, you can launch a native threat locator. Target a friendly colony. I like, uh, I like Penster here. The shabby wilderness. It's a pirate spawner. After a long and exhaustive analysis of a available archives and sensor data, our scientists are ready to present the results. Scientists are like, there, there's, uh, there's, there's pirates over there. You gotta gotta go over there. Yes. Maintain the rendezvous. You are healed a bit. A bit. If we're gonna be here for one more turn, let's just give you some nanite injectors so that you don't suck so much. Hmm? And we'll commute. You can heal on the commute. Yeah, just wait. Off you go. Crash melt. There's all kinds of stuff out here. Yeah. Do some uh, manual. No, let's do some auto combat on this bug. My chair almost killed me. Don't mind. Uh, auto combat. Everybody lives. Production resources moved to Custerville. What should be built with them? Let's build. Ooh. Okay. A basic research facility to provide a boost to research effectiveness. Only one central structure can be built. Or unlocks the ability to build specialist units here. Uh, we're busy with our production stuff. Cost 100, cost 150. Built the science lab because it takes less production because we're currently being extorted and our alternate solution just is probably getting assassinated as we speak. So we're going to have to come up with that production. Which is a big damn shame. That's just more... Man, they've taken all the good spots. Oh, I control the assassin. Great. Run. <laughs> Best we can annex the sector. Means you have some people, don't you? Yeah, they're split up. They're fine. I'm gonna deprioritize. What does putting people up on this do? 
This allows you to decide if you want to have maximum, minimum, or balanced income. Ah. Happiness up, lower income. Okay. Stay happy. Stay happy. Morale is not huge. Auto does that. Yeah, we have a lot of energy right now. Okay. So, so, so. We can annex something. We could have annexed that if we knew ahead of time. Uh oh. Ah, uh, how disappointing. Well, I thought, uh... Hmm, I don't know how that works. I made zero prosthetics for you. Does that mean I'm making zero production for the other guys? Who are demanding 500 production from me? How does this work? Colony overview. Like, am I making production towards my quest objective? Operations available for priming. How does this work? Okay. Um. <clears throat> there. I have made zero of 500 goods. All colonies can contribute. How do I make them contribute? I probably need to not be producing other things. Refund the colonizer. And I, now I bet any production I make per turn. 60 goes to the colony center. So is that 60 in profits going towards... my ransom. <laughs> Hopefully that's what that means. What about Penster, are you... You're almost done making a trooper. This is... that's worth it. Okay. Oh, our great monuments and works of art attract a range of enemies. Our refined ways trigger rage in savage minds, as if smashing things they don't understand makes the world right for them. Five quartzite units. Kill them. Lisa Walker wants to join. Oh, now we're talking. Avoid tech hero. You're a phase walker? With void blades? Cost 100 energy? <laughs> Welcome aboard. Can you move? Yes. Join up with them. So you have... You have five. You have two. There's almost enough here for... Two armies. Hmm. You. <coughs> Join. Then you... Group up. And move in. Yes. The assassin. <laughs> Keep running this way. Are you good? Are you like a real unit? You're a runner. You have a lot of mods. Yeah, you can fight. Tell you what. 
Those assassins were like three units. Balancing this is a little tough, but maybe our Voidwalker can go try to take care of those assassins. Uh-huh. Just checking shit out. You can keep an eye on them. That might be good. It's just two. That makes a little more sense for, for me now. Grab that. 30 research. Good shit. <laughs> Hello, Michael Valentine. <coughs> Look at him. Vincent Gladstone. I should have known it was you who had returned to leave six. The air has reeked of arrogance ever since I heard the reports about the landed sleeper vessel. Valentine. Somehow I am not even surprised to find you alive. Bad weeds grow tall. Still, I never expected you to turn against your precious Petragon friends. What happened? Did they no longer look handsome enough for you? Typical. Mocking other people's misery. While you were frozen solid, the rest of us struggled for survival. My position granted me cryosleep access. With a war to fight, I've been in and out of cryosleep in anticipation of some sign of the Star Union would return. Imagine my disappointment to learn it's just you. Spoken like a true hypocrite. This is why I always enjoy chatting with you. Fun times aside, don't you agree that it is time to end this unnecessary bloodshed? Unnecessary. I am not surprised that you fell for Hui Jiang's innocent act. Go ahead, ask him what he did that night in the Elysium Parks. For my cooperation, prove you're not just after my supplies. Go to Sector 43B. Pyrrhic fires threaten our energy reactors. Quench them and we will talk again. Objective complete. I guess he was in there. Assault bike. Convince Michael Valentine to cease fire. We can either defeat him or reach an alliance. I want to alliance with these people. It's way over there. It doesn't show the map. To remove a hazard, you first need to complete the society, research, environmental conditioning. I think I just did that. Assault bike. Oh yeah. Join up with our new hero. Lieutenant, you look unsettled. If there is something bothering you, you know you can always speak your mind with me. Thank you, Commander, but it's nothing, really. No reason to be concerned. Not a solid one, anyway. Die you, just spit it out. Alright, Commander, but you must promise to keep this between us and not embarrass me in front of the squad. Ever since we landed, I've had this eerie feeling that I'm being watched. I can sense that something is off, but no matter how hard I pay attention, I can't find any concrete evidence to support my paranoia. Some paranoia may be healthy when you're stuck between battle lines of rogue vanguard squads and an opportunistic syndicate house. The last few weeks have been rough for everyone. First leaving our past lives behind in cryosleep, now this madness. Just don't let the situation get to you, die you. We're all in this together. Thanks, Vincent. You are right. It was probably nothing. Probably nothing. Can I get in there yet? No, Ericor. I'm never Research more complete. Than when I can unleash hell on the enemy from the skies above. We fly free. We fight free. We die free. Let's keep Fire it optimistic. Polo, Vanguard pilot. We have a gunship vehicle. Heroes can ride in it, and we have a unit. The gunship. Select new research. Some combat sensors, void technology. Drone deployment. Electromagnetic utilization. Electrified ammo and rail accelerators? Sounds dope. Let's do it. Sounds dope, let's do it.
set production in Custerville. Uh, yeah, but we're trying to get production to... I'm building surplus production right now, right? Like, that's the whole point. That is the whole point of not producing any units right now, so I can pay off my freaking ransom. But I don't even know how much production I have. I know I have plus 95 per turn, presumably. But, uh, beyond that... Beyond that, I don't know. Where's my quests? Event log? No. End turn? No. See, I still have zero of 500 production for House Timur. I don't know how to set that up. Unit production, structure production, sector production, colonists, colony center. I don't, uh... <clears throat> Do not know. Oh! Structure production. It's in structure production. Okay. Structure production down here in quests. Okay. Okay, so after that finishes. Okay, good, good, good. Good, good, good. We know that the different squad leaders have been enjoying Prometheus weaponry throughout the planet. Employing. Hui Jiang mentioned the Molten Earth Arsenal, which had to be reconquered, so I would assume it is a supply base where those weapons are stored and manufactured. Sounds like a place that we should pay a visit. I am still not sure if Valentine was mocking me when he referred to the Elysium Parks. Sending me on a wild goose chase through deteriorating pleasure parks sounds like something he'd enjoy. Still, I cannot ignore the possibility that he has a point. As opportunistic as he may be, Michael Valentine is still a vanguard officer. Vanguard officers don't joke about war. Find the Promethean military base and explore Elysium Parks. Cool, 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 cool. Paragon has demands. Ah, just the person we are looking for. It has come to our attention that tribute has not been made. Please do so, for the sake of a good relationship, of course. You're lucky I'm made of freaking uh, electricity right now. Just made of it. It's there. important to imagine this patch of land without the raging hell fracture of cosmic death spewing forth pollutants from a dimension of pure agony and horror. <laughs> Phil Dunford, Imperius for Colony Real Estate Agency. Some of the dialogue is pretty funny here. So this lets us remove things and build botanical gardens. Very important. Uh, which we also need to remove the hazard for something for a quest, I think. So that's good. That's the stuff. I can fabricate a cause of war with covert infiltration. Operational support. Operational effectiveness one. That seems good. Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's get in. Port six. Save. Oh yeah, saving tapples finally. This landmark is an advanced production sector. Enter. Oh, it unlocks the following building, a spaceship maintenance bay. Hell yeah. It's a safe battle. I have some new units. Let's do manual combat.
Right on. It's invisible. Not right on. Enhanced targeting. Also bad. And that is a Golem Autonom. Tactical face. The forcefully applied contact explosive. Oh god. It's an explosive punch. And the bomb. The body originating mass blast hits all adjacent units. Boy, let's see if we can kill him first. This is an engineer. So engineers can place a sentry gun once per battle. They can repair a mechanical or cyborg unit. And they can assist targeting computers of friendly mechanical units. Okay, so basically you're gonna come plant... You're gonna move up. I don't want to plant the turret until I'm sure that thing is going to advance, so... I'll hold that. We'll move up here. Targeting flare. Ooh! I can hit him from far! Targeting flare that lasts for three turns. Does it just highlight that spot? Yes, it illuminates an area, so he's probably going to move, so we'll hold that. Gunship can use an aircraft gun, which has a, a good range. Or use a buster missile. Area of effect. Nice. Alright, you'll come up. You might be a, a flanky flanky. I don't think that guy can get you, even. Overwatch. Done. Move up. Overwatch. Move up. Overwatch. End turn. Operations ready. Nobody does shit. Classic. Move up. Out of range. That's fine. Taking it slow. See if that's better for our success. Move the NGs up. They're, uh... Pretty funny looking. Those little engineer suits. Let's pop a turret here. Cool. Zoom out. <laughs> oh, the turret has a, a bad shot. Can also do an overwatch instead. You can move up. Probably too close. Get some shots. Nice. Oh, it tells you when you have line of sight. Good. Ninety-five percent chance to do seven. The aircraft gun is pretty weak, it looks like. Did blow some cover. It's just you. Does red mean you can be attacked? Maybe that means I have a shot. <clears throat> yes. Take it. 
That's fine. Supply drop? From space? Oh. Repair. Transmitted repair. Some grazes from the turret. That was good. Some hits from the Overwatch. That's good. And that's bad. <laughs> Got hit with the tactical face there. Uh, you're going to heal it. Repair. Awesome. And you're just gonna blast it in the face. You're gonna take an overwatch hit. You're gonna blast it back. It's going to explode. Not in, a, not in a super bad way, that's why. <laughs> I have a 65% chance. Let's move into full cover. Which means we don't have line of sight. We'll move up this way then. Move our APC up. You're probably not going to have a shot still. Everything's way out of range. That's fine. We'll drive you around. I can move you... You have a shot here. A graze. Riveting stuff. Take cover? Take this cover, actually. Blow your action. Excellent. And you can do nothing and turn. Ooh. These lasers are no joke. Okay, that was fine. Okay. Alright, okay. No line of sight again. There we go. Blank, yes. Not yes. What the fuck? That's weak shit. You have shots. Take them. Oh yeah. Uh, you have a 60% chance to destroy this completely, so... Instead you miss and graze and miss. That's disappointing. I need you... to kill that. <laughs> Come on! The, uh... This does not move. <laughs> Let's see. We can hunker down, can we... We can't move the drone, so you have shotguns. You can move up. Maybe you can shotgun someone. You can move up and take a shot as well. Maybe you can be the hero. All right. Enemy kill. All right. We take those. Yikes! Can you just buff yourself? You have psionic resistance and a defense laser. What'd you just do? It's a metabot. Did it just say it self-identifies? The metabots self-identify as Autonoma Monitor Units now. They've repurposed their surgical lasers to punish rebellious orderlies. The whole hospital is hostage. 
They, dis they disposed of the infirm and order us about, like, machines. This is not a hospital any longer. I sniffed the packet stream and I see directives like exterminate, kill, and enslave. Their core medical directives have been overwritten to favor self-interest and replication. They appear capable of connecting and spreading their mechanical rebellion to any machine with the capability of networking. The Automoms show all the signs of being alive. Dr. Talon... Talon Dweer. That's awesome. I mean, it's terrifying, but it's awesome. Please be destroyed. With the miss. 80%. Plug it with your ACP. Enemy annihilated. APC. Our every every military victorious. boogaloo in my channel gets triggered. Okay. Again, that was supposed to be a safe battle, but could be worse. Tapples! The robot euphorically jumps from Dayu Jiang to Vincent Gladstone, slewing its antenna in excitement. Come here, Tapples. Now there's a good boy. Though you have to never run away like that again. Just look what you got all of us into. Looking around may actually be worthwhile on this occasion, Lieutenant. Do you remember how all the ships here had been polished and flagged for our launch day? Now they look as if they belonged to, to a museum, or the deconstruction hangars on Gardip 20. Almost makes it feel like a living ghost. I get hella production, and a tier 4 Phoenix Breath primary weapon. Dope. Objective complete. I got the pug! What is the pugs? The pug tapples. Is that a hero? It's an army commander. Show me more. I want to see more of tapples. Full unit details. Ensign Arnie thought it would be if be funny to prank Sarge. So he stuffed his dessert rations into the healing charge of Sarge's pug. I think he just forgot about it. A month later, we were ambushed by bugs, and Sarge gets hit. His pug was working fine. It was blurred and returning fire with its blasters. All's good, until Sarge calls for medical. Normally, it'd heal him right up, but instead it sprayed him with chocolate pudding. That's when the battle took a turn for the worse. Got a personality matrix. Shaped like a flower, this chip created by Fang Jiang enhances Topple's, Tapple's jolly nature and grants the high morale aura, which increases the morale of friendly biological or cyborg units. Interlocking armor, <coughs> combat sensors. He's got a blast laser. Can't equip a primary weapon. That's awesome. Tapple's. Apples, my boy. What am I gonna do with you? Maybe you join this ad hoc resistance group that's going up north. Let's do that. Armies merged. Excellent. Which means I can only move as far as he can, which means I don't get to move at all. You're coming down this way to reunite with us. We'll all just meet up, like, right here. And then we'll go fight the assassins. I still really need to go there, too, though. I think you're in a good position. Lieutenant Chung's in a good position to hit that, so I think that's how we'll do it. Hydro plants. What is this, the Blood Sea? What is this tile? Oh, it's ocean water. Why is it totally red?
This drone, you're still keeping tabs on uh, the assassins up here. You, you're down a unit. Imperial Complex Landmark. Old Star Union Sector Base. Extinguish the Pyre Expires. Okay, so you'll head this way to take care of that quest. Yes, yes. And you... We'll just rendezvous. You can move again. We could go after these pirates. That is also a quest. Let's just, yeah, okay. Four forty, six ninety-seven. Should should be able to do it. Let's see. Let's do, let's do that on our next turn, and then probably end it there. Well, the assassins are running away. Ah, we've been extorted successfully. I knew we would end up getting along just fine, darling. These supplies will be enough for the moment. Unfortunately, the same can't be said about your less cooperative van friends. They destroyed several of our energy storage devices, leaving us without the reserves required for another journey through the void. So unless you can help us replenishing our energy... You won't be able to leave the planet. Very clever. I don't believe a word you're saying. Just be careful not to overstrain my newfound taste for diplomacy. Oh, and one more thing. Call me darling again and I will personally make sure it's the last time. Objective complete. Okay, so that happened. Pay a thousand energy. Oh my god, what is that? <laughs> okay, we'll accept until we can get this blackmail sorted. That is the geothermal instability. Hazard removal. So if I can pay the cost, it'll just happen in three turns. But then there's that fucking thing. Well, army power 660? That seems bad. Link up. Out of move points, god damn it. That's fine. We'll all just keep moving up this way. Where are they going? Okay. Let's do it. Safe battle. Manual combat. Manual combat. Take us in. I like this army. Those guys are bastards. Purifiers. Oh, I hate them. They can, like, annihilate you from so far away. Probably from here. There's an overwatch. Do they have an overwatch? Yes, they do. It's kind of dicey. can shoot him from here. 25%. Targeting flare. 
This is kind of a choke point. Maybe this is a good plan. Let's help our drone here. Where's your overwatch? In this outfit here. Twenty-five percent. Oh. Not quite far enough. Okay, so we'll take a vanilla shot. <coughs> a whopping four. The drone hits. It's hit with an overwatch. Out of range. This is tough. There's not a lot of, there's so little cover that I'm guaranteed to get like it. Or something else shitty. Oh god, these guys. Well, okay. Jesus. Jesus. And the bugaboos. Sweet messes. Sweet messes. Operations available. All around. Operations available. What do we got? A laser strike. Nanite support station. Reactive phase protection. Drops a nanite support support station onto the battlefield. Built-in blur, which gives obscure and heals adjacent friendly units on each turn. Oh yeah. Right there. Thirty-five. Fifty-five. Go turret, go! Good hits, good hits. I want you to move. See, now everyone's spread out, so I can't bomb them. Move you out here. Should be able to take him out this turn. I can if I just plug him right here. Come on, APC! Yes. Enemy down. Cool. Uh, go ahead and repair. Actually, that doesn't make much sense because it's going to heal. So instead, let's make it even more accurate. Calibrated. What a nice little noise. You can get up here completely exposed for the flank. That's pretty good. Woof. Uh... Yeah, take some shots. That backlash is a bitch. Every time you hit it, it pops. Any chance of killing it? Doesn't really look like it. Also, 16% chance to hit. What the fuck is that? <laughs> Go 
Good cover. Good flank. Got shots on everyone. Do damage to that thing while it's not next to any of my units. Okay. The Engies! No. Lieutenant Jihak. Oh god. <clears throat> That's fine, she comes back. I'm just gonna drink my tea. Ain't no worry. I think tactically I'd rather the she die, right? Did we get that healing zone? No, I don't think that deployed. Select. Oh, there's only certain valid targets. I didn't deploy the thing I thought I was deploying. Learning opportunity. Probably fuck this guy way off, right? To save him. It's not gonna work. <laughs> Watch that totally backfire. Ooh, 75%. The grazes. They kill me. Step back. I mean, you gotta. You're just gonna have to take the backlash. He missed. Fuck him. Fuck him with your shotgun. I missed and hit Lieutenant Jiang, who is still alive, actually. <laughs> Wait, do I still get to have her vehicle? God damn it. 95% <laughs> to take that out. Do it. Enemy eliminated. Just a 30% chance to take them out? Is it because of this cover? I guess we'll take the shot. Miss. Hit. Graze. These things suck. There's some cover there. 27% chance. Why is it so hard to hit? Hero lost. Lieutenant Jiang is boned. Unit down. He just walk right up to me and point blank grenade. What the fuck is your problem? What kind of a fucking decision is that? Move here. I think that's a freebie. 65% chance. Get the kill. Safe battle. Enemy down. Everyone takes damage from that backlash. Unit down. That's okay, that's a fucking turret. <sighs> Enemy eliminated. Our forces are victorious. 
Yikes. I mean, actually, yeah. So Lieutenant Jung springs back with half health. Lost their vehicle, though. That's a bummer. Aid rig. Okay. That's a bummer, but uh, we are victorious, and we're going to end the episode there. We are just over an hour now, so that's it for today. Later.